you know that talking about focused breathing is like my favorite thing to talk about. Holy shit, there's nothing I would rather talk about. This could be the best day of my life. What is focused breathing? Welcome back to EPRV TV viewers. It's Chris Nichols here. We've got a short little educational video for you today. When we do our lens reviews, you often hear us complaining about focus breathing or praising lenses that lack focus breathing, but you might not know what it is. So we thought we would talk about what focus breathing is and how it's gonna affect you, whether you're a photographer or a videographer. But let's start at the beginning. What does focus breathing mean? What does it look like? So it works like this. When your lens focuses to infinity and then to its closest distance and back again, you may see that the focal length of your lens actually changes. It actually looks like your lens is zooming, going wider, going more telephoto as you focus near and far. This can happen on zoom lenses. This can happen on prime lenses. And some lenses are worse than others. It really just depends on the design and whether the manufacturer has tried to correct for that or not. Ideally, a lens wouldn't have any change in focal length when you focus through, that would be a lens that doesn't focus breathe and that would make Jordan very happy. So a lot of photographers might not even have ever heard of focus breathing. It doesn't keep us up at night. It doesn't bother us. And that makes sense. I mean, first off, a lot of older lenses out there, they didn't really correct for focus breathing. A lot of them had some pretty major results from it. But the fact is that when we focus on something closer, we generally naturally recompose the shot anyways. And any change in focal length isn't really bothering us very much, but it is still a factor. Now, where it might really affect your photography is if you like to do focus stacking, where you take multiple shots at different points of focus with the idea of getting more depth of field when you combine them all in Photoshop. If your focal length is changing every time you refocus, that's really gonna hurt your stitches, it's gonna mean that you're not gonna be able to use the full field of view that the lens is capable of doing, and that might be something where you want a lens that is focus breathing corrected. But where is it really gonna affect people? Let's talk to Jordan about videography. So videographers and cinematographers, my people, have been complaining about breathing for a very long time. When you're doing a narrative film and you want to shift the focus, you want that to be completely invisible and draw the viewer's eye where they're supposed to look. However, you will notice it if the frame is zooming every single time you touch the focus ring on a lens. And focus is changing constantly in film production. It's very distracting and we really want to avoid it. That's why we're worried about focus breathing. So video and cinema lenses have been correcting for breathing for a very long time. It's something that we really prioritize, but a lot of videographers were using DSLRs and mirrorless cameras and their photographic lenses in order to shoot video. And that's why we were seeing this breathing becoming a real problem in a lot of productions. But now a lot of the stills camera manufacturers are paying attention and this makes me happy. We're seeing great stuff from Panasonic and now Nikon and Canon with these breathing corrected lenses that work great for photo and for video. Well, there you have it. That's focused breathing. And now you guys know what to look for. So if you are looking at a lens and you're worried if it's going to affect your videography or your photography in a bad way, now you know how to check. Watch our videos because we like to review these lenses and talk about focused breathing. 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 Or when you're in the shop, pop the camera on a tripod, get that lens set up, and just see as you focus from close to far if the sides of those frames are changing too much for your liking. As always, thank you so much for joining us. We love making these videos for you. We always think about you. We just want to give you guys unbiased reviews. And all we need from you is to think about us and hit that subscribe button because that's how we get to keep doing what we love to do.